Hi everyone. I uh, look like I've got a halo, don't I? It's Leonie here again, just out of the shower, this time looking a little bit more respectable, huh? Um, I just want to do a quick video and talk to you about soaps. Not all soaps are equal. Okay, so I'm just going to flip the um, camera. Okay, in front of me in here we have three of doTERRA's soaps. We have the moisturizing bath bar, which is just the spa um, bath bar. We've got a serenity bath bar, which is has the lavender piece uh, blend in it. And we have a citrus bliss invigorating bath bar. You can actually see that this one is actually a little bit smaller than the others. So it's a... Um, it's a four ounce one. Oh, actually, it says they're all four ounces. Well, there you go. Whatever. It's just got a smaller, smaller box. Um, those are doTERRA's body bars. Now, what I'm going to show you is this is a cake of soap that I've been using for a little while now, mainly because I just wanted to use it up. It was a goat's milk soap. Look how manky and, and cracked and ick, ick, ick it's become. Contrast that to my spa moisturizing bath bar, which is this green one, greeny blue one here. That I've been using for quite a while. You can see that it's it's quite diminished in size, can't you? And look, it hasn't cracked, it hasn't gone all manky, it's just gradually been used. So, all soaps are not the same. So the value you get out of buying your doTERRA soaps is really quite immense because it's not going to go yeah, like that, which is just about ready for the bin. And look, it's it's almost, I mean, it's almost whole, really. A bit pissed off about that one, actually. But um, what do you do? There you go. So do yourself a favor and try doTERRA's bath bars. I don't think you'll go wrong. They're really delicate. They're lovely. They smell great. And they clean, which is even better, huh? That's it for me. Bye.